Hey guys, Metal Viking E2 here, back with the third and final stack of plunder for the day. I told you it had been piling up. Um, still got one more to go through, but I'm going to wait a few days because I've also got some um, pre-order stuff that's supposed to be showing up this week, hopefully. So, fingers crossed that that shows up because, like I said, I am going out of town at the end of next week. And I want to try to get as much done as I possibly can, including a couple of reviews. So, yeah. Moving right along, the first three here actually came from Head Split Records, which is one of my favorite places to order from. They're primarily a tape-based label, but, you know, they also sell CDs and they put out CDs of their own. So, yeah, this first one is not a release of theirs, but when I saw that they had it, I was like, I've got to pick that up because I have not put, uh, listened to this band in a while and I haven't gotten anything from them in a while. And that is Pro Fanatica with Altar of the Virgin Whore. Of course, Pro Fanatica, black and death metal band, originally from Brewster, New York, uh, now based out of Connecticut, been around since 1990. This is their fourth EP overall, and uh, this was put out by Hell's Headbangers in 2018. Of course, you know, you should know Pro Fanatica, really solid stuff. Cannot wait to listen to that one. Now, the next two are actually Head Split Records releases, uh, 2021, so brand new. Uh, both debut full lengths as well. We're going to start off with Anthropophagus with Death Fugue. And uh, yeah, this is a death metal band from Montague, Massachusetts. Not exactly sure when they formed. I could not find that information out anywhere I seem to look. But uh, yeah, really sick death metal. I would highly recommend checking this one out as well as the other one, which is Morbific and Ominous Seep of Putridity. And this here is a Finnish death metal band that have been around since uh, just last year, 2020, debut full-length album, and uh, yeah, really solid debut. I would definitely recommend checking this one out for sure. All right, the last little bit of this stack came from Paragon Records, which, of course, the classy one himself, Lonnie, has talked about quite a bit here recently, and so I decided to check him out for myself. Uh, found some stuff that I was interested in, and most of it is bootlegs. Um, and I've said before, I don't mind bootlegs as long as it is something that's, you know, like a live show or something that's been in long out of print and there's very slim chance it's ever going to get a proper reissue or anything. I don't have a problem with that. So I found some really cool stuff and, uh, they even emailed me after I placed my order and gave me a list of stuff, said, Hey, pick one of these and it'll be a freebie in your order. I'm like, all right, cool. So yeah, we're going to start things off with a split release between grotesque and at the gates which are basically the same entity in a way because, you know, Grotesque split up and members of that went on to form at the gates. But regardless, uh, Grotesque were a black and death metal band from Gothenburg, Sweden. They were um, formed back in 1988. Uh, I forget the exact date because they split up originally, then they reformed and they split up again. But uh, yeah. And, of course, At The Gates, everybody knows them. They're, you know, melodic death metal. Same place, formed back in 1990. And this is basically a uh, bootleg compilation of an At The Gates set uh, from 1992, as well as the, um, what is it called? The Black Gate Is Closed demo from Grotesque from 1989 and a live set from 2007 when they had reformed briefly. Uh, I've listened to a little bit of this, didn't get to completely listen to it at the time. But, yeah, what I heard sounded pretty good. This one, oof, this one is raw, and I'm talking raw. This is uh, Dark Throne and Mayhem, the true legends in black. And I do believe Lonnie actually showed this one himself at some point. But of course, everybody knows Dark Throne, black metal band from Norway, been around since 1987, and Mayhem, they've been around since 1984, also from Norway. And this is also a uh, bootleg compilation featuring Dark Thrones Thulchondra demo from 1989, as well as the original uncut version of Mayhem's Death Crush demo from 1987. And like I said, this is some really raw stuff. It's very interesting to listen to, but damn. Next up, we have Sodom Live Germany Persecution Mania Tour. Of course, it's basically what it says a live bootleg of a show uh from the per persecution mania tour of germany in 1987 and of course you know everybody should know sodom teutonic thrash metal band from germany formed back in 1981 and i actually listened to this here recently and sound quality is actually really good i have to say 
Um, there's a few little hiccups in the sound, but I think that was mostly what happened at the show. Just a few little burps, nothing major or anything. It's just kind of like a little blurb, and then all of a sudden it gets itself corrected, and we're good to go. But whoever, you know, programmed this for, you know, when you put it into a CD player, uh, did not do a very good job because all the tracks are not what they say they are on the display. But, yeah, really solid. If you get a chance to check this one out, I would. And the only one that is not a bootleg, this is Flesh Grind with Live in Germany. And uh, I've been seeing this around quite a bit here lately. Uh, anytime I've been trying to find uh, any of Flesh Grind's material. But yeah, they are a, or should I say, were a brutal death metal slash grindcore band from Chicago, Illinois that were active between 93 and 2005. Uh, this is a live album recorded at the Fuck the Commerce Open Air Festival in uh what is it? Nerden, Germany in 2000. Uh, this was released by United Guttural Records back in 2002. Have not had a chance to listen to this yet, but uh, definitely looking forward to it. And then lastly, this is the freebie that I picked because uh, this seemed kind of interesting. Because I believe I actually have uh, something else from this band, though I could be wrong. But this is uh, Sufferatory with Pseudo Philosophic. And, uh, yeah, this is a brutal death metal band from Russia. Been around since 1998. This is their first EP. Uh, it is a co-release between Savard and Butchered Records in 2008. Now, I am not sure if this is exactly how it comes. Probably not, but it was free, so I can't really complain. But while everything is pretty well legit here, it is basically a handwritten CDR. I seriously doubt this is how this came originally. But, uh, you know, like I said, it was free. It's definitely worth checking out. All right, that is going to do it. Thank you guys so much for watching and subscribing. And until next time, stay brutal.